Welcome back, my friends, to more Lord of the Rings Online. In the last episode, I started doing some of the Dol Amroth quests here. If you're unfamiliar or you missed it in the last few episodes, there are multiple different districts and factions here in Dol Amroth, and each of them have quests that you can do for them. Unfortunately, you're only allowed to do six quests per day, and so I started that long, arduous process in the last episode, and... I think I'm just going to randomly pick up quests that I haven't done until I start noticing that they're starting to repeat and then I'll probably reference my completionist checklist and start tackling down the last few ones. But for now there are plenty left to do to where I can just start picking them up. So I did all these in the last one, all of these fishing ones, so let me pick up these next. Tholfin is caught and caged. These are troublesome times indeed. The Corsairs have been raiding Tolfenis for food and supplies heavily these past few days. They've been catching more than they can eat and have set up small cages around the island, holding the creatures where they are caught. Freeing the creatures from the cages will disrupt the Corsairs' food supply, cause them confusion and delay in having to hunt them again, and hopefully save animals as well. Take a boat from the harbor to Tolfenis, search the shoreline for cages and free animals within. Gondor needs your aid. The trees on Tol Finnis are quite important. The wildlife that lives there relies on them for food and shelter. The roots also keep the island from slipping into the waters during the more violent storms. The Corsairs have settled there and are cutting down without care or concern. While I want to stop them from being able to build more ships, preserving the island is very important as well. Use a small boat in the harbor and head to the island. Once there, find some suitable locations to plant some seeds so that we can begin growing a new crop of saplings. How may I help you, friend? The ravens on Tolfenis are very important to us. They are messenger birds and often used in hunting. I have heard the Corsairs are raiding the ravens' nests and stealing their eggs. Those eggs are then being used for breakfast and not for hatching. Use the boat in the harbor and head to, and head to Tolfenis. Once there, ascend to the heights and find the nests. You'll need to be quick once you grab the first egg or the Corsairs will surely notice. How may I help you, friend? Every animal contributes a purpose and a value to all others. When one is removed, the others will suffer. The Corsairs have spread snares all over Tolfenis and try to catch the rabbits and squirrels and other small creatures. These creatures allow the forest to grow and the larger creatures to exist. Take a boat from the dock to Tolfenis. Once there, remove any snares you find. I expect they will not be hard to find. Okay, good. So, these quests come in bunches. As you can see, there's four quests that I'm going to be doing in this region. And then, this guy, he gives you a group in of four here as well. So, for now, I'm just going to keep these four quests. I'm not going to pick up any others. I'm going to go do them, and then once I'm done with those, I'll see about what I'm going to pick up next. Now, one thing I want to do is set my milestone here so I can quickly travel back once I'm done with some of these quests. Now, besides all these Dole Amroth quests, the only thing I have active on my tracker is going to be the Epic. So, I might work on that a little bit this episode as well. We'll just kind of see what happens. Alright, got my milestone here. Now, I need to head down to the docks. So, that's actually going to be this way. The docks will allow me to take that boat to the island where these four quests I just picked up are going to be completed. Looks like I'm still going the right way. Just take the shortcut through here. Yeah, I kind of did a little bit of researching to see if there was any way I could do more than six quests a day. Whether I could buy mithril points to reset them or anything. But it doesn't seem like it. It seems like I really am stuck with just six per day. I have no idea how long this is all going to take me. But we'll have to see. So these are repeatable quests I've done well, already next. as well. Yeah. Repeatable quest. So I'm going to skip that for now. We'll just do what we haven't done yet. And then figure it out after that. The 
bolt boat is here to toll finish. Let me go. Pretty long loading zone here. So just for reference, I am here on this island off the coast. So what am I doing here? Man, I wasn't paying too much attention. Destroy cages, plant seeds, collect snares, and venture to the heights. Here's a snare. Can't believe this hind is looking at me aggressively. I'm trying to save you, bro. I'm trying to get rid of all these snares. And you want to fight me? Yeah, so I don't know if there's going to be a big delay between Western Rohan and this season. But if there was, just know that it was because of this. Because this whole Dol Amaral thing is really going to slow me down since I can only record so much in a day, you know? I may want to just play the game for 50 hours straight and record the entire season, but it's impossible at this point. I am limited by the game mechanics. And no, I do refuse to go on to the next season until I'm finished with this one. It's just the way I am. It's the way I've been doing it. I don't want to change it. I think it works well, even if there is some delay. The biggest delay I ever suffered, besides me and real life stuff, was the Tower of Orthanc. I don't know if you guys remember that fiasco, where I had to do the Tower of Orthanc raid. And I just could not find a group. I could not find a group. I don't know why, but I remember that took months to be able to find a group to run through that. That was the biggest delay I've ever had in this game. And I certainly hope, hope this whole Dol Amaral situation doesn't eclipse that. That would be sad. Planting some seeds here. This guy wants to attack me. Might not be able to get out of here in time. Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh well. And I have to kill it. Alright, so I missed something. Go back to that purple circle that's marked on my map. I think one more snare here. Actually, seven more. Or three more. There's one. Gonna take the strawberries, why not? Some of these, unfortunately, I have to dismount to use. That's okay, though. There is a final snare to the southeast. The very southeast. Okay, so done with that one. Good. Gotta destroy four more cages.
I like the idea of having these islands off of the coast and having boats at the docks that can transport you here. I think that's kind of cool. I don't know if we've seen too much of that. I know there's the boats in Lake Even them that take you from one end to another. And there are a few islands there, but... Yeah, I guess there are. I guess there were little islands you could take a boat to and even them. My god, even them seems like a lifetime ago. That was way back in the day. It still remains one of my favorite maps. I love that map. The, the storyline there, the quest lines, they're also well written and well done. And the map is very beautiful as well. And the music there is excellent. Alright, one more cage. Poor little fox. Okay, next up, I gotta keep planting seeds. And then finally I have to summit this place and get some of the eggs. That's interesting. He's fighting the the heart. Huh. plant five more. Four after this one. Don't eat me, bear. Please don't. I'm leaving. I promise. Interrupted. Alright, looks like I'm at least headed towards the summits. Well, the quest is telling me to go there. It just became closer than the other dirt piles. I'm expecting a lot of enemies here. Raven. The nests are here. Quickly, gather the eggs. Oh, I have to... I have a time limit on that. Two minutes. Need to grab ten of these. Ten in two minutes? That might be a little tight, actually. Sneak here. Let me just kill him. An egg here. All right, we're we're getting there. More than halfway through, with half the time left, so we should be all right. And last one. Good. So now I just gotta plant two more trees and then I can get out of here.
Okay, good. Now let me use my swift travel. Back to Dol Amroth. Threats guy. Now there's this as well. There's a bunch of different quests that Gondor I can get needs your aid. through the training exercise area, so I should also be grinding those. How may I help you, friend? In a few days' time, we will need to return again, perhaps to free some of the animals. But for now, they are safe, and the corsairs are delayed. How may I help you, friend? This is a start. We will have to be vigilant to ensure these ones are left to grow. These are troublesome times indeed. We can get a full clutch from this many eggs. I will see to it that they are properly cared for and hatched right here in Dol Amroth. When the island is ours again, they shall return home. How may I help you, friend? I am sure they will place more, but every day and bit that we can delay them is a victory for us. Alright, so yeah. 24 hours on all those. And I can only do two more of these Dol Amroth quests today. That's the guy I already did all the fishing stuff for. So let me see. I mean, I'm going to have to break these up. There's no way around it. Because most of these come in groups of four. But I can do up to six in one day. And so I might just have to double dip. It's not as organized as I, was I would like. Ideally, I would have one episode for all the quests in one area. But... I think a good compromise to keep things moving along is that I break some of these up. So I'm going to grab two of these quests. And then tomorrow I'm going to have to come back and do the other two. And then a group of four from somebody else. I hope that makes sense. So, yeah, let me let me just pick up a couple of these. Gondor needs your aid. The Corsairs know not what troubles they awaken. Nor do I think they care. Their explorations of the tunnels beneath Emin Ernil have awoken several beasts from the depths. Deep Claws. Large lumbering creatures that, when awake, serve only to dig. We cannot allow the tunnels to collapse from their work. The deep claws must be stopped so that we can continue to search and recover whatever of value is beneath. Head into the tunnels and defeat the creatures. How may I help you, friend? We've seen Corsair flags on top of Emin Ernil. I believe that they have scaled the sides of the mountain and somehow found a way in through some of the cracks and open air caves. If they are down there, they are surely exploring and mapping the tunnels. Search the tunnels and find any Corsair surveyors. Make sure their information doesn't get back to their ships. Okay. So where is this? Let me open up my map. So it's all the way over here. The epic is over here. Hmm. What is this place called? I'm on Lontier. Let me see if I can ride there. Can I? Through the stables? And then I can also do the epic quest. That I've been kind of putting off. Let me go to the stable and see where I can ride to. So yeah, I do apologize that... The next few episodes are not going to be as organized as I was I would like. It would be nice to get all these Emin Ernil quests done in one video, but... For the reasons I've already explained, just not going to happen. Gondor needs your aid. Kellum Bell. Where is that? I forgot already. Probably over here, huh? Oh, that's Todrant. Kellum Bell is over here, so that's not going to help. So yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to ride to where I'm trying to get to. There's not a stable there. That's the problem. Okay. I'll just manually ride. But I'll do so on the war steed. Let's go. Gonna go to the caves first and get to these tunnels.
It looks like I'm gonna have to go up and then go south following the mountain ridge. I don't know, it seems like... Yeah, let me go up through here and then turn around. I think that's the right path, as far as I can tell. And then from here, I can go do the epic. Should be coming up on the entrance to the tunnels. Okay. Good. Oh yeah, by the way, some of these Dole Amroth quests you cannot access until enough people on the server have done other quests. So I guess this is one of them. So these caves are closed unless there's 8,000 out of 8,000. It's kind of like that one thing in Lothlorien, the Battle of Lothlorien. But anyway, good to know this is open in my server. What am I doing? I'm killing Deep Claw Diggers and Corsair Surveyors. I'm gonna have to be careful here, apparently, because these are tougher enemies. I like the design on these Deep Claws. I like their golden look here. Very cool. do a desolation on this guy. There's plenty of them in here. I haven't run into any of the surveyors, though. Thankfully, these guys don't automatically aggro on you, so I should be able to run through them. Once I don't need any more of them, that is. Just two more. Messing up my gambits here. Okay. Now let me go in deeper. See if I can find some surveyors. Very cool area. It looks massive. A miner. I don't... Do these count? No, they don't. They do not. What about the foreman? They do not count either. Miner. Foreman. Foreman. Minor. Maybe I have to go to an entirely different area. Unfortunately, it looks like I'm going to have to fight my way there. Is this a dead end? Yeah, it looks like it. And as you can see, there there probably was another quest to kill miners. But couldn't grab it, unfortunately. You know what? With editing, I could probably keep all the quests in one location in one video. Now that I think about it. Like, what's stopping me from just editing all that together? 
and releasing it in different episodes. Like I record it over different days, but then I edit and splice them together. I might do that moving forward. I don't know, I'll have to think about it. Because it seems silly to... I don't know. Alright, I'm done talking about it. I'll figure it out. Either way, we're gonna have fun. You guys are gonna enjoy it. Although I'm fighting all these guys unnecessarily here. Looking for surveyors. Horser surveyors are exploring the tunnels beneath. Okay. So I don't get any more distinct description of where they may be. Let me go explore a different area though. Let me go off this way. Wait a minute. Yeah, let me go this way. There we go. Couple surveyors here. Nice. And looks like I should probably stay up here. more oh no oh no what a troll bro that is such a troll oh well at least they came back to me okay I don't think I can leave instance here yeah I didn't think so that would have been too convenient I think this is the entrance let me head that way and see yeah Nice. Okay. Trying to decide. I mean, we're getting close to the 30 minute mark, but I think I'm going to make this episode a little bit longer. Because I do want to advance the epic storyline, and I am relatively close to it. So let's go do the epic, and then I will... Do my milestone skill to re return to Dol Amroth and turn in these two quests. I don't think anybody minds these slightly longer episodes. In fact, I think I'm supposed to talk to somebody up there on that beacon. I will return, but there is something I must tell you first. You say- We are under attack. You say that Lothriel has commanded my return to the city? I will return, of course, but there is something I must say to you first, young one. Nedros laughed sharply. You have interrupted me during a brief lull in the battle, my timely new friend. I routed a group of Corsair raiders, but they are certain to return. Indeed, I hear them approaching. Once more. They return with allies. more coming in from the side here. We have victory. Now we'll return to Dol Emroth as Lothriel commands. Okay. So now we need to go over there to Lamedon, but I will leave that for the next episode. Let me return to Dol Amroth. I guess I'll just do like one step of the epic storyline per episode as I'm grinding these Dol Amroth quests. 
think that's probably the right thing to do. That way I can get around to this 30 minute mark or so. I'm sure there are more down there sleeping, waiting to be awoken. But for now, the tunnel should be safe. These are troublesome times indeed. We do not know the full extent of the tunnels yet ourselves. Until we do, the Corsairs cannot have that information. Okay, good. So yeah, for next time, I will do the two quests that I missed from this guy, and then probably the group of four from here. Although... Yeah, are they different? They're in the same place. Oh, that'll be good. Because then I'll be able to do all them in that one place. Okay, that'll be nice. Let me open up some of these boxes. Get some of the rewards. Get some of these dull Amroth tokens. docks from everything i kind of want to open them on screen just in case it changes my reputation or whatever i guess it doesn't matter that much if i'm being fully honest all right that's enough opening for now so for the next episode i don't think i'm gonna jump into those quests yet i think for the next episode i'm gonna end up doing a run of this These a run of the training indeed. exercise so either way it's gonna be a good time thanks for watching see you next time Thanks for stopping by the Renaissance Gaming Monastery. I hope you join our community on Discord and Twitter. These videos are produced with a lot of hard work and love. If you think they're worth a dollar, I'd be grateful for your contribution. You can send a thanks donation or become a member on YouTube. You can also support through PayPal, Patreon, or even with cryptocurrency. All links are in the description. See you on the next video.